after that shooting happened, there were calls to disarm the campus police. And so that really made me think like that, that could be here if that same thing happened. Um, and so I wanted to address that and say why that that's not a good idea and disarming campus police uh, would do more harm than good. I don't think that every DPS officer or like yellow jacket who's helping out on the outskirts needs to be armed. That signals that there's a lot of like safety issues and I don't think that's the case. The first time I saw a policeman with a gun was just after I had arrived. Um, in America and he had like two guns just on him and that was really really shocking I found it very scary I come from New Zealand and now policemen don't carry guns people are very tied to their firearms here when they shouldn't be um, including the police force I don't really think that there's an, like a need for them um, I feel like there have been too many cases especially recently of police officers obviously shooting unarmed innocent people What's unique about USC Public Safety is our officers go to the LAPD Academy. So our officers receive the same training, in fact, more training than all of California peace officers. And there is a significant amount of time in the academy and post-academy when officers are working here on firearms training. So they're very well trained. most important factor in students staying safe here at USC or any university in a similar urban environment are the decisions and choices they make. Safety is a partnership. If we can get the students to do their part and not do things to become vulnerable, this is a very safe campus.